Hi, in this video we're going to show you a few ways to save images from a Google Docs document. So you might have noticed by default if you want to uh, save a picture, you could click on it, you could right click on it. There's no, uh, you know, there's copy, but there's no download or save uh, option there. So there's several ways you could go about doing this. Uh, first way is a really simple way, and if you don't care about image quality, if you just need like, you know, to paste it into an email or something, uh, you can do a search for the snipping tool. And just do a new. And then you could just save this as whatever you like, and then you're done. Like I said, that's just you know kind of like a lower quality way of doing it. So another way is to right click on it, go to View More Actions, and then choose Save to Keep. And then this will open up your keep window on here as a note, and then you'll have it in here. And then you could right click, save image as and then just give it a name wherever you want to put it. So the next way, if you want to do this, is to click on File, Download, and then Microsoft Word. This is assuming you have Word. Then it'll make it into a Word document. And then you could right click on the image here and save picture as. And then finally, the other option is to go back to download and pick web page. So this is a good way if you have multiple images, because this one has, you know, this has two images in here. So you had 20 images. Uh, file, download, web page. And then you'll have a zip file. And then you'll have an images folder in here. And then you'll have all your images separated out. So then you could just open up each one from here and, you know, you know, extract the zip file. And then you'll have all of your image extracted from your document. So once again, the snipping tool, just take a picture of it. Uh, Right-click the image. View more actions. Save to keep. And then you could right-click save image from there. Or you could download it as a Word document and then save the images there. Or you could download it as a web page and then extract the zip file. And you'll have all of your images downloaded at once. All right. Thanks for watching and be sure to subscribe.